exploring new places. That's what we've built our life around. If you've been with us since the beginning, you know that's been sort of a mantra for us. It's the reason this channel exists. It's the reason we risked our old lives and it's what we desperately want to inspire you to do. Usually when our intro gets serious like this, it's a setup for a bad punchline. But the only joke here was the entire past year. 2020 took travel away from us, all of us. Borders locked down, states locked down. Forget exploring exotic new places. Many of us couldn't even venture home for friends and family. This is a new year, a new beginning. And unless aliens attack or we get the actual zombie outbreak we've been promised, things can't help but get better. Welcome to 2021. You're watching Tripped, the new reality of travel, masked up and socially distanced. The world's starting to open. Subscribe and come with us. Everybody, hope you had a good Christmas. Uh, we're here at Rocky Mountain National Park today. We swung through the park on our way out of Colorado. We wanted to do this last year. Timing didn't work out, so we picked the windiest day possible to visit this year. Uh, today we're going on a hike to three different lakes. The first one, interestingly mm. named... Bear Lake. Let's go see if there's any bears. With Bear Lake thoroughly explored. Most and this cool hat. <laughs> and the fact that it's only 300 feet from the parking lot. <laughs> the actual hike today is to Emerald Lake, which is just under two miles from the trailhead here. Uh, we're also gonna hit Dream Lake, which. Are you winded? <laughs> Me too. <laughs> uh, this is embarrassing. Is We've been farther. living at 9,000 feet for a month. <laughs> well, that's what the altitude on the screen here. I'm not sure what it is, but. We just walked the distance that you can see right here. Maybe we stop and talk in the future. Next time. <laughs> On we go. Wait a second, we're already at our second lake, but this feels way too easy. As usual, everything good is up, and we've been just hiking uphill since last time we checked in here. Wait, this, this can't be it. Why not? Because isn't Dream like, like the main attraction in all of Rocky Mountain? I feel like you're doing that thing I did at Yosemite. I'm like, that's not the Dawn Wall. That's not the Dawn Wall. We'll have to find a sign. Oh, there's a sign on that side of the lake. Maybe the other side of the lake, you can see the mountains in the background. Or we're going the wrong way. <laughs> One of the benefits of being here off season is there's no crowds. But without the crowds, you know, like you, you always follow the crowds to the major sites. This way you have to explore <laughs> the beautiful sites on your own. It's like, how, how do you do that? 
Don't worry, there's definitely still people here. Yeah. <laughs> Reading all the Google reviews and like blogs about this before we came out here, just talked about how crazy busy this is all the time. So maybe this was the best time to pick to come up here. That's true. Where's the people? Actually, we see the people on the other side of the camera. You just can't see them. And they're all, they're all, they're all in the spot. We're gonna have to wait, wait for our turn. Oh yeah, this is gonna be sweet. Wait, this is it. This is it. Guys, guys, this is it. Uh, are talking for this lake or for the whole thing? Or? Yeah, yeah, that's great. We saw a bear at Bear Lake. We're at Dream Lake now. We're gonna talk about dreams. While we have the entire lake to ourselves, we thought we would just sit here and thank you for spending 2020 with us, for helping us achieve our dream. We hit 100,000 on the channel this year, obviously because of you. That was incredible for us uh, in a really tough year. As you can imagine, I'm sure the uh, travel industry was kind of rough in 2020, um, but you stuck it all out with us and we've had so many new people join this year. So we just want to say thank you for that. Thank you also for those of you who chose to make trip travel gear part of your Christmas or heck, just like domestic travel vacations this year. That's a big deal that you put trust in us to buy gear for your next adventure and you know, trust your vacation with us. And then for me to launch a course this year, have over 50 of you join me to start an entire new life in FBA EDU, building an Amazon FBA business. Not only is that really special for me that you trusted me to kind of guide you into a whole new career path, but that 50 of you are ready to tackle 2021 with an entire new career to like get out on the road, become a digital nomad. That's so inspiring and so exciting. So those are really, I think our personal big achievements of the year more so than just like the hundred K or something like <laughs> right, in right. inspiring actual real people is what's, uh, like the point of all this. So uh, just thanks for hanging out with us this year. We're excited about 2021. Very excited, like so much has happened just in the past week. Vaccine rolled out. We have friends who've got vaccinated. That means for travel, things are gonna be opening up soon. Like the process has started. Borders are gonna open for us. We have a crazy ambitious amount of places that we've already booked tickets to uh, that are allowing tourism, other places that we're just kind of banking on the fact that they'll be open by the time our flight is ready to go there. Uh, it's gonna be nonstop 2021. All right, bears at Bear Lake, dreams at Dream. What are we gonna talk about at Emerald Lake? Well, we'll have to come up with something on the next part of the hike. <laughs>
stream, Mike. <laughs> we didn't mean to lie earlier. We just didn't know any better. As to, this is dream lake. That doesn't mean the dreams down there weren't real. Those were real dreams. Well, you know what this means? Well, we'd like to thank you all for a really great 2020. <laughs> really looking forward to 2021. <laughs> Nobody wants to hear that all again. <laughs> Wow, check this place out. Subscribe and join us in January. We will be. <laughs> <laughs> Subscribe and join us in January where we promise to take you somewhere warmer. See you next week. Like any site we've gone to ever, it always feels good to come out at 11, see a full parking lot, pass a whole bunch of people on the trail coming back, knowing that we had, you know, essentially all those lakes to ourselves, which was fantastic. So always get there early if you can, avoid. I mean, this is just a Tuesday, it is Christmas week, but I bet that this place is, whew, I got my backpack on still, swamped <laughs> during the summer, so. I don't think that we even knew how good we had it. I'm sure some of you have been here and you can let us know how busy it was on the day that you arrived. This is, I need your help. I'm stuck in my bear hat with my backpack. Will you help me? Oh, okay. Oh, and the camera. Trail baby. Oh wait, this is the camera. And then the backpack. Okay, okay wait. here's the camera. Okay. Oh, it's warmer now. Let's go get Pepper. Trail Ridge Road is another one of the like beautiful scenic points here in Rocky Mountain National Park. It's closed during the winter season, so we unfortunately can't do that right now. Um, and we're really, really just scraping the surface. We know, don't don't uh, hate us too much for doing that. It's uh, you know only 11 a.m. and we're already leaving after just a couple hours here because we are gonna grab Pepper and head out of Colorado. This is it. So thanks so much for sharing December with us out here in the Rockies and uh, we're, we're heading to warmer climates now.